this video will demonstrate what I am talking about as drawing to learn. So we've done a lot of readings on drawing to learn and now we're going to practice using it for our own learning. And I just wanted to show you that I practice what I preach and that I've been doing this for quite a while now and it gets better each time. I use it for meetings, I use it for all kinds of things. In this case, I wanted to show you, this is a podcast that I was listening to on the sacred art of listening, and I really wanted to absorb this material. I really want to become a better listener. So I took vast notes, as you can see, for, for the entire, oh, I think it was a hour long podcast. So it was audio only. Now, with videos and audios, we can stop and play. It's not like live note-taking in a classroom. So feel free, as you're doing the practice this week, to stop, get what you want down on paper, and then go on with the recording or the video. Here's another one. This is actually from a conference call. And as you can see, I just insert these little things to remind me to bring me back into that moment in which the call was taking place and what I was trying to remember and pay attention to during that call. This is another one. I'm going to turn it so that you can see it. This is another audio note-taking from a podcast on um, heart training on the Bodhisattva path. So it was um, Buddhist methods and, and ideas on intention, attention, and action. And this is how I captured it so that I could go back to it and review it and remember some of those key points that I would really like to incorporate into my life. I think that's, and you can see, I keep journals all the time now. This, this page will remind you of the visual vocabulary that you guys have been working on. And this is uh, one of the pages. I practice this um, in my journal and I practice it on the iPad. And as you can see here, I've used uh, visual note-taking practices for live TED Talks. I'm actually the visual recorder for TEDx Fulton Street. And you can see how I'm using this in professional practice. I think that's all out of that book. This is another conference call. As you can see, I've got little things in there to remind me of different points, important points in the conversation. This is from a live workshop. And I'm taking notes throughout. It's like two days, a two-day workshop, and you'll, you'll see it goes on. And then these are, this is another conference call. You can see I'm, I'm really trying to remember all of the wonderful things that people are talking about during that call. This is from a live lecture. It was so dark, though, I couldn't get more than this. Um, but it was with Art Spiegelman, who is a graphic novelist. Fantastic talk. I wished I could have gotten more, but the auditorium was pitch black, and this was all I could grab. And this is actually an audiobook that I'm listening to now. And I'll go back in, and I'll add color and review my notes so that I can have more of a chance of remembering this material that I'm trying to learn. Just a couple of notes. I want you to stop and play the videos and audios as necessary as you capture your notes. I want you to, before you start this practice, review all of the resources that I gave you from module two. And remember, what I'm going to be looking for is your effort and detail in what it is that you capture, not the quality of your drawing. The quality of your drawing is not important, but what you capture and clear progress from your first notes 
to your fifth notes um, is what I'm looking for. Anyway, have fun. Take off. <laughs>